Okay, so for anybody that's watching this channel, um, I'm gonna have to actually go back to the other videos I made and make sure that they don't have music in them because apparently if you have more than like seven seconds of any other music, it's like copyright stuff and I don't wanna deal with any of that. So that's why I have the headphones on. I am a rocker. This is going to be me jamming to rock and maybe a little bass nectar later. <laughs> um, that's when I get really into it and stuff. But um, yeah, I want to better myself and go on this journey and figured I might as well chronicalize. Um, I'm going to be gaming because I'm a gamer girl and I earn my gaming time by working out. So I do fast paced workouts sometimes, I do low paced workouts. They're all gonna be low impact because the leg is shredded. I have issues with my ankle and balance and all that. So, you know, but I'm trying and we're gonna try and I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. Um, today, I am going to play a slow paced, so slow paced um, game. Um, the building games and stuff like that, uh, you can not shoot or games. Um, you can kind of go low pace with it and do your thing and aerobic size or whatever you want to call it. And yep, got my water and lemon juice. So had my coffee already. Um, I have my list of things in my life that are learned behaviors that might be contributing to my problems. Um, I'm still working on the list and adding to it and asking, you know, friends and family if they noticed anything um, and picking out the learned behaviors from there. So I have been fighting depression. I'm severely depressed. I, I will for weeks be just inconsolable and just dredgy and just <laughs> bad stuff. So I'm trying to get out of that mind frame by lifting myself up and being productive and doing something and doing something about my life and changing all this because I want a certain kind of life and I'm going to work towards that life. If I'm not working towards that life, then I don't want to do it. So I will be jamming out um, on my headphones you're gonna kind of have to imagine what my music sounds like. I will be listening to like Deftones, Five Finger Death Punch, the oldies, you know, like uh, old rock, um, Alice Cooper, Osborne, you know, all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoy the channel and I'll try to uh, turn down my uh, gaming sound a little bit um because i don't really need it to, you know because i have it all on um what is it transcribed whatever um okay if the top of my head gets cut off in this video i've had this problem um sorry just gonna have to imagine what my face looks like my moves i think are more important for the video so i'm going to start well going to start the game and it's loading and I'm going to do a warm-up oh forgot to turn on the music uh, and we'll start there <sighs> all right it's a good warm-up song so since I'm loading I'm gonna actually put that down and I will pick up my five pounds because this is what I've been working on is like my wrist strength and normally like I would be sitting and let my hands go and I don't know why it works better if I do them one at a time I think because maybe I'm concentrating on only one but I never let it curl down so far that they're gonna fall because you really hurt yourself. I've done it 
don't do that. Um, I gr basically it's a grab and then lift thing. And then I go with just sitting here and lifting. And if I'm sitting watching TV or anything like that, that I don't need my hands. Um, and sometimes while I'm gaming, I'll use one hand. Um, I'm, I'm always going to be strengthening my wrists. I have a lot of friends that have wrist problems. Um, and there are different exercises. You can go like this. You can turn it like this. You can try to keep your hands um, stable, kind of, and shake them a little bit to try to keep them straight. But that's more of like an advanced move, which I don't think I'm at that yet with five pound. I do it three pound or two pound. Uh, not sure where my three pound are, but lift, 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 lift. Oh, these headphones are really acting bad right now. Maybe because the computer's on the floor. And this, you should feel it, like, you'll feel it, like, right here. And I feel a little bit through here. So I can feel the workout. And just, like, watch your muscles, whatever. Then there's, like, the motorcycle, what I call the motorcycle, the rev the motorcycle. I can't do that with these, though. I'd have to switch. So... not progressed enough for that and just do as many reps as it when you start to feel a burn like you know the, the workout burn you you're you're wanting to stop because it hurts and you don't like it um it's a sensation that you don't like but what I want you to do is get concentrate more on the music or on the tv whatever you're you know watching or whatever and keep going until you know you feel like you've done a good workout um i'll keep them at the sides and lift up like this and i'll also do backwards like that and then i go to the sides with the motorcycle and then i go in like that and since my game's ready i'm gonna start doing my regular workout. Um, but yeah, this is what I do and how I do it. I kind of warm up first and kind of get into the music a little bit. This is a really good song. It might pump me up enough for me to grab the things and This is a uh, detec detective -y game, so. <sighs> yeah, never sit and sit for long periods of time. It's not good for you, it's not good for your body. If you wanna keep moving, you have to stay in motion. If you want to get so out of shape that you'll never move a muscle again, then go ahead and feel free to stop and just sit there forever. <laughs> um, people have been commenting on, well, to me anyway, on um, that they don't know how I'm surviving in the pandemic or whatever. And it's like, yeah, try, you know, almost three years of bed rest and then talk to me, you know. Imagine not being able to move from your bed. Some people can't move from their bed. Some people are in wheelchairs, they can't move, you know. It's not like they can get up from the wheelchair and say, bye-bye wheelchair, I don't want you anymore. So I kind of do whatever I can do and I don't care how nerdy I look like, because it's a workout for me, you know, I don't care. In the beginning, I always go slow. Um, just because I, I don't want to hurt myself. 
and I want to be able to go the full two hours or so that I work out which this video won't be that long because I'm gonna cut it off at some point anytime that you can stop your game because you're building or whatever and the materials have to process pick up your weights do something doesn't really matter about like as long as you're moving um, sometimes when I work out I'll control I'll go all control and go really slow and pay attention um, but usually I don't because I, I want to jam out to the music I'll go drums I'll do overhead drums which is good for this muscle. It's like those exercises that people do like this. I don't know if you can see this, but I go jamming. Come on, headphones. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll go jamming. Um, then with my bigger weights, I'll do pickups from the floor. I'll put it on the floor, pick them up, go like this. And then, or I'll just sit here, play one-handed, and keep going like this with whichever weight you want. Um, it's a lot of stuff you can do one-handed, you know. And the only thing that matters is the movement, really. I can't go long with the fives. I, I can go better. The smaller weights are gonna tone you up anyway. Um, you'll just have to do more reps. So, listen to Smile Empty Soul, listen to a lot of stuff. Um, this is a good rock out song tool. If you'll play, please play. Let's see if it's only that headphone. No, it's definitely both of them. That's crazy. Huh? My Bluetooth and the Bluetooth things might be dying. They are like three years old, so. Let me go. When I do the drums, I try not to let my wrists like go all gyroscopy. I try to keep them fixed. And I try to keep my arms like kind of stiff too, like try to stop them from going that way as I'm doing it. It's like the same basic concept of the uh, shake weight that everybody loved, you know. Reach for the sky. Reach for the sky. Reach out. Punch the person on the floor. Maybe it's somebody you know. <laughs> Punch forward. Air. <laughs> it hurts. But like I said, if it hurts, keep going. Try. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Go like this. I do that after that move because it's kind of my shoulders that hurt after I do that, so. Doesn't matter, like my right one is more worked out than my left one, which could be the case. So, um, oh, sorry about the hand thing. I'm going to work out this arm a little bit more. Until it burns like the other one. There we go. Not that much. <sighs> like I said, you can work out even if you're sitting down, watching, if you're binge watching especially. Like, you can straighten out your leg and do this thing. And I have um, 
leg weights somewhere. Um, I add those in later if my legs aren't too tired. And that's how I do that workout. Um, I'll keep going until like, my legs will fall off. Um, but if you are watching TV or whatever you're doing, you can do this and still be into the story. And it's really a good workout. And then you can go because apparently like horizontal is good for going the rest of the way. But sometimes I go all the way down and then go horizontal and up. Like that. And I do it fast. On the, when I go down is when I wanna, I try to go slower and more control. Because if you have that control, it's better. You're not having your muscles go out of control. <sighs> Jamming. And don't think that low, low impact means you're not gonna work up a sweat. You can work up a cardio sweat. <laughs> Maybe that's why the YMCA song was so popular when it was. <sighs> okay. Okay, gonna do more legs now. And I kind of switch off like that. Gotta earn it. Gotta earn it. Trying to find one area of the map. I just made me lean on my legs a little bit more. I mean, you can keep going. Um, I mean, obviously, if you're starting to hurt yourself or anything like that, yeah, definitely um, stop the movement. And I just found out what's wrong with my headphones. They're dying now, apparently. <laughs> Won't hold a charge, okay. So, I'll just keep going as long as I can with the music. And when it dies, I'll just have to wing it and pretend that I'm hearing music, which isn't that hard for me. Um, and just for me working out, um, I kind of uh, know what the playlist is. Okay, and now since my leg is hurting me, I'm going to um, try to stretch it. And this is what I do to stretch it. It's up to you if you want to do this. This is really the only way I can since the surgery. Ah, uh, no, no, no music, no music. You're killing me. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to use my other headphones. I'll do that. I use my gaming headphones. Okay, so. I'm gonna make sure those are off and I don't know why they weren't charged, but. I'm gonna grab this. Why are you still going? I turned you off. <laughs> Weird thing. Okay. And got my 
headphones and hopefully, uh, is our noise canceling headphones? Very nice. Okay, let's make sure we can hear that. Okay. <laughs> so now that I did that stretch, it feels better. Um, and now I'm kind of gonna go, if you've ever rollerbladed or ice skated or anything like that, you're gonna go like this and push off side side kind of like you like you see the skiers go like do that with your legs it's like a side chop thing it's very good for your legs um this movement actually um is probably the reason i was so fit as a child i loved rollerblading so much when they came out i was like ah! i was lucky enough that my dad bought me though i was a very lucky child So, I'm gonna keep going like this. Work through the pain. And now I'm over the, the pain hump, so to speak, or wall or whatever they call it. Glad I stretched that line. That line. You can do this with weights or whatever. I just choose to just go with whatever I feel at the time. <sighs> Song's over. I always take like bending breaks and bend whatever I'm working out like or stretch. And you're gonna wanna stretch at some point behind your back, but I can't, i am gotten too big, obviously. Um, so I have, um this rope that I got like for three bucks. I mean, it's it's similar to an old belt really. And I use this um, to like hook it onto my ankle and stretch my leg and it kind of helps me stretch sometimes. So I'll put this behind my back like this and just wherever it's comfortable to go stretch. I stretch backwards like that. And then I also use it for stretching. Um, let's see if you can see this. Just stretching, cross stretching. Let's bring it down. Because I used to be able to um, reach that, but because I got bigger, I can't really. And kind of go. This helps me focus my stretch. <sighs> okay. Feels great. So, I think I've done. I mean, you can do squats if you if you can do squats. <laughs> um, I kind of you like to use the walls a lot, and um, I like to use the chair a lot. Um, I'll kind of go really slow in and then getting up and I'm squeezing like my buttons when I come up and I'm never just sitting like I, I think I said in an earlier video but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get redo that one exactly the same way so um, when I'm sitting I kind of um, squeeze each butt muscle on either side and I'll try to like kind of go with the beat of the song which is kind of fun or I'll do both um, I'm never just sitting I'm always like lifting my leg up or something some kind of movement because I promised on my list to myself that I would not sit for more than 30 minutes without doing workouts or moving unless I was watching a movie with a friend or going to the movies or something like that. Um, a lot of people can fall into, you know, a hole and they just, over time, it just gradually gets to the point where they're not moving anymore. And that's kind of what happened with me. 
partially because the bed rest, partially because uh, I used to not leave my house really, so I had a point in life when I was, you know, just, just everybody outside is bad, I'm not going out there. <laughs> and yes, it's very scary to go out, but just stick to non-vampire hours, you should be fine. <laughs> Um, nicer people are out in the daytime. <laughs> if I knew that years ago. I, I am a true vampire though. I love like, staying up all night was like my dream schedule. <sighs> hmm. I also have the window open fully so that I can get some, some vitamin D and my dog can't walk around the block anymore, but I try um, to walk around a baka at least once during the day. Um, but yeah, a lot of it is movement, just dancing. I'll just do whatever with the, with the dumbbells. And now I'm going to have to take these off, which is why I wanted the other thing. Because um, I'm going to show you the wallet.